Good morning, everyone. Today, not really in the best mood, but it's okay. Life goes on. Anyways, this is what we're doing. Uh, recently, we went desert camping with uh, Amanda's brother, Dakota. And before we left, before we went, we tried to start up the generator for the trailer. With COVID-19 and everything going on, it's been a while since we've gotten the trailer out. Uh, with that being said, the generator hasn't been turned on. With that being said, fuel sat in it, and now the carburetor and generator shot. We had the extended warranty on the trailer, but you know, those carburetors, they don't really uh, qualify for those extended warranties because it's a maintenance issue. So yeah, it's not gonna be covered. That's all right. It's only $700 to repair. Not a big deal, right? So we called uh, Bobby Wayne's RV. It's where we got it up here in Lancaster. And luckily Amanda was able to convince them to let us bring it in tomorrow because they said we don't have any open maintenance spots until February, which is not good because we want to go camping in a couple weeks again in the desert. We need that generator. So they said, fine, you can bring it in, uh, nine o'clock sharp, ask for Kenneth, and we'll get you in there and we'll fix it in about an hour and a half. So how we're gonna fix this problem is we are going to put, what'd you find? You found some money in there? Yeah, for you. Oh, cool, thank you, hold on. It was at the bottom. It was at the bottom? Declan's finding money now inside the truck. Okay, so uh, last time I was at the shop, the guy said, put this fuel valve on the fuel line right before the generator so when you're done camping you turn off the fuel valve to shut off fuel to get to the generator let the generator run all the way until it shuts off so then it's completely empty with fuel and the guy said if you do that then you're not going to have any issues and it'll be a brand new carburetor every time you go camping so we'll see but yeah so that's what Declan and I let's see where Declan is what's up buddy good you good what's up are you driving? Yeah. Nice. It's hard to turn this. Yeah, it's not on. Power steering. So, uh, that Declan and I are going to go to Bobby Wayne's RV today, uh, bring the trailer in. Hopefully, they fix it quick. Plus, we have Declan's new shoulder pads in here for dirt bike riding. We bought them some recently, and they were too small. So, uh, they said you could just bring them back and change it off for a bigger pair. And luckily, that dirt bike shop is across the street from Bobby Wayne's RV. So, drop off the trailer, get some new shoulder pads. Hopefully, they have the right size. And chest protector. Yeah, that's what I mean. Chest protector, shoulder pads. Yeah. Yeah. And we're going to go riding in the mountains again. Declan wants to go dirt bike riding again. Yeah. Yesterday was like his first time getting out by the mountains on his own. And uh, if you missed that video, check out yesterday's video. It was a lot of fun, wasn't it? I want to uh, go over there later. Later. If we have time, we will. We'll see how today goes. Okay. All right, you guys ready? Let's hit it. After we do. I'm still stuck with some tough decisions, yeah. Now I'm up against the wall. And I'm looking for your All right, made it to Bobby Wayne's RV. They want us to drop the trailer off and leave it in the middle of the street. And then they'll take it in with their forklift. So that's the plan. And and what, Where, where's Declan back there? There he is. Uh, you little sneakers. All right, we just got done uh, getting Declan's new shoulder pads. Where are you at, Declan? There they are. And there was a car crash. Yeah, so pretty scary. Um, They didn't have uh, so first, they didn't have Declan's uh, shoulder pad size, or the bigger size of his shoulder pad, so we had to get the other ones. These are cooler, uh, so we had just exchanged them, paid a little more for them. Uh, but while we were in there, there's a big car accident out here on the road. Uh, can't really see it right now, but you can see it just happened. There's sirens out there. Cops are out there. We'll go take a look. Um, but yeah, it was a good experience, uh, learning experience for Declan to see uh, kind of the bad car accident and show that you have to be careful when you drive, huh? Because yeah. if you don't be careful, if you drive into a car with a big truck, the truck is going to destroy it. Yeah, so you got to be careful when you're driving. Okay, let's see if we can get a better look at that car accident. Popos everywhere, deputies. I haven't seen a CHP yet. What's a CHP? 
CHP's Highway Patrol. Looks like deputies are handling this one because it's on the uh, roadway here, not the highway. All right, guys, we made it back from the trailer service place, dealership, whatever. And uh, we're about to start up this generator. They said to run it for about 45 minutes or so, turn on the air conditioning, draw some power from it, and get it going. And then when we're done, uh, that's when we're gonna turn off that fuel valve and see if we can run it dry and see how that all works out. So, fingers crossed. I mean, they started at the dealership, but let's make sure it's still gonna start for us, okay? So let's go inside and check it out. All right, so here's our little uh, fuel station area. Um, all we gotta do is prime it. Here we go. Oh yeah. Started right up just like the good old days. So let it run. We'll set a timer for 45 minutes. Bam. Generator back up and running so we can enjoy the desert camping the way we should. And the reason why we got this trailer is to be able to dry camp with the generator and have power and heater for the kids. Um, but yeah, here it is. Running good. update back here looks like he's kicking out right here all right guys figured i'd give you guys a little vineyard update uh while we let this generator run and do its thing try to keep everybody posted on what's going on today is january 6th 2021 so this is its third year third year going dormant um but yeah you can see for yourself the vines are all dormant see some old grapes froze out but yeah here they are Here's the vineyard. Everything's done for the winter. So this, you can see the leaves just falling off. I like to keep the leaves on, I think it looks kind of cool. But yeah, so they'll stay like this until uh, springtime. I forget what time of the year it is. I think it's typically late April, March, April. Late April, early May to when they start uh, blooming and doing their thing. So that's gonna be exciting uh, this year. We're gonna need to set up uh, netting over everything. This uh, next coming summer is supposed to be our first harvest where we're actually gonna try to make some wine. Um, yeah, so that, that's a, a quick a, a quick vineyard update. When I was in the trailer, I found a little cold brew coffee sitting in there. So yeah, cheers. And that was your vineyard update. Now, back to the show. All right guys, hope you enjoyed that little update. Anyways, uh, so yeah, generator's running good. Finally got the air conditioning going. When I first turned on the generator, I didn't realize like there was no power in the trailer that was stressing me out. Couldn't figure it out, realized that the little breaker switchy thingy on the generator was kicked off. So I kicked that on, full power to the trailer, have the air conditioning running, run it for a little bit. We're gonna shut that valve off, run that thing dry and have it ready for our camping trip. And I'm sure mommy's excited to have the generator back up and running. Yes, I'm very excited. It was actually my idea to get it fixed. I did all the legwork. Daddy just gets to turn it on and say, yeah, it's fixed. <laughs> well, I mean, in all fairness, I did drive it all the way there. But yeah, I mean, mommy mommy made it happen. But we've call in the shop. Teamwork. teamwork. Uh, so now we don't have to cancel our camping trip. That We're ready to everyone uh, change the dates for for us. <laughs> a bunch of people change their schedules for us, and then we were stressed out about even going because of the stupid generator. But we got it working, so now yes. we're ready to go. Now we can look forward to our camping trip and not have to borrow your mom's generator or anything working. like that. So yep. we're good to go. Yeah. Good to go. That's the end of this. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. Uh, we're going to be, Declan and I are going to go ride some dirt bikes right now. He's uh, getting antsy. And then, yeah, a couple weeks, we're going to be going to the desert with this trailer. Dirt bikes, a bunch of people will make a video for that one too. All right, see you guys. We're gonna use you to go camping. Oh yeah? Yeah. And we're gonna go filming? Yeah, and we're gonna turn you on forever. Ever? Yes! Oh boy. Yeah! <laughs>